Yo, what is up, everybody? It's your boy, back in another video. And today, just like I said last week, I'm gonna be giving y'all the best limited lineup for this week. So, let's get right into it. I'm also gonna be hopping into a game, trying to get my third ring. So, these packs just came out. Leave a like, and I'll do a pack and play. So, I know you're guaranteed a player. So, I'm probably gonna put a lot of duplicates in it. It's gonna not gonna be a fun pack and play. It's gonna be like basically an all Inferno squad. If I get duplicates and I still need to fill it in, with um, extra VC, I'll probably just go fill it out with uh, any one I get from this pack. Hopefully, I can even get someone there. If not, we're gonna find all the base players that I get. So that's the plan. Um, that's maybe, maybe if y'all want to see it. If y'all don't want to see it, um, I'll probably, I don't know, I don't know, cause a lot of these players are good. I might do a J.R. Smith gameplay or this MPJ. All my says he looks nasty. I'll probably I might do an MPJ gameplay too, cause I feel like everyone's already gonna take these top four right here and this eight and this, uh, the, well, for his price. I'm guessing he's not that good. So anyways, when we go to the limit eight over here, this is what you have to do. So you must include ten players in the twenty one current team, which means there's three players where you can basically free of your choice, except only one diamond player. No galaxy, put no pin diamond, no freeze, no heat check. So that means you get one diamond player and two other amethyst ruby or whatever to like 21 current theme. Um, right, and then the rest, or uh, and the rest just have to be current theme too. So basically, the player of my choice, the diamond, I want Rudy Fernandez. Basically, this is where you just put in your best diamond player. Whoever your best diamond player is, just put him in. Now for me, point guard. And who, so... You have to put in 10 21 current team players, which means there's two, or you can absolutely just put any any amethyst or any ruby you want. This ruby, Markel Fultz, is the glitchiest point guard in the game, and it's important to have a really good backcourt and big men in this too. So that's why I wanted Ibaka, and because Ibaka, you know, great defense, great, he can shoot. So uh, these three cards are, this is all you, whatever your play style is, your collection, that's up to you now. Since it's 21 current team, you really can't have a good squad, but the thing is, I did not pick the best squad at all. So, if you're looking for the point guard position, well, you're in luck. I suggest, um, if, I don't know, this is like a bucket type lineup, but this Steph Curry right here, man, this guy is a phenomenal star, obviously. The shoot, the shooting, shooting, dribble, damn, that's all you really need for him. So, that's. So that's why Steph Curry's a good one. Another good one, Damian Lillard, because he could also shoot, dribble. Kyrie Irving, nothing different, shoot, dribble. So all of those guys are also good. I just decided not to pick them up. Now, if you have a Ruby, I'd use this Trey Young. Uh, Russell Westbrook, do not use him. Cannot shoot. And you need guards to shoot. Chris Paul, same here. He only has a 79.3. If you could green really well, I suggest you pick him up, but that's all up to you. Uh, I'm going with Trey Young on this one. Uh, if I use two 21 current thing point guards, I will go Chris Paul with my backup. Or maybe I just bump it down to Sapphire tier and pick up one of these guys. I've not checked their threes, but I suggest you don't really pick them up. Because the Ruby guys are budget and you can pick them up. Now, when we go check over the shooting guard spot, I have Devin Booker coming off the bench. Now, Devin, there's Devin Booker, Donovan Mitchell, and Bradley Beal, really. And those are Sapphires. Now, if we go to look at the shooting guard rubies amethyst so one person paul george and clay thompson both phenomenal shooters is donovan mitchell yeah he's all right but if paul george is a phenomenal pick him if you want to pick him up because he can do a little bit of everything because his the last thing about him is look at that defense 88 defense so that's one good thing and then clay thompson obviously we know he's gonna be a sharp shooter not to mention the defense once again phenomenal defense so Paul George just basically lets you, if you want to dribble a little more, that's all he literally does more than Clay Thompson. But otherwise, I take Clay Thompson to be honest with you. So both phenomenal cards there. Now there's also a James Harden and a Luka Doncic. This Luka, I, I don't think you should pick him up. You know, low three pointer. He could go to the rim. No, he can't. Though he can't seven driving dunk. You know, he can dribble, and that's about it. This Luka is a fat L. I don't know why Harden is not popping up, or no, my bad, I think Harden's a diamond, yeah, and you only have one diamond, don't want to waste on this type of stuff, so, now, if we go check out the small forward position, I got Middleton and Ingram, but I got one hidden gem for y'all, I'm gonna cover both of the forwards right here, now, if you all check out, the reason I didn't pick them up is because of the price, this is Jason Tatum, this is Jason Tatum's a beast, 
he is an absolute beast. He can shoot, go to that rim, he can, he can dribble, good enough, good defense. This Jason Tatum, at a forward spot, is a glitch in this. I highly, highly, highly suggest you snipe his card. His card is a hidden gem right now, for at least for this. Now, if we go check out the Amethyst spot, obviously nothing's gonna pop up. If we go to small forward, we're gonna see Jimmy Butler. You know, you're probably thinking Kawhi, KD, and uh, LeBron. Nope, do not pick them up. They're diamonds, and they're not worth it filling up your diamond spot. Now, the problem with this Jimmy Butler is everything. He can't shoot. Uh, his going to the rim is far worse than I think it should be. He's just, he's just not good. There's so many cards better that are rubies. And if you have a small four ruby, do not pick up Ben Simmons. Unless you have a lot of shooters. For me, it's all about shooters. And that's what it's, I think it's really about. Because if you can't shoot, going to the rim is going to be a struggle. Because you're going to make a star just as good as you. Or like, if you're going to, if you have like a pink dime Ben Simmons that just came out, that would be huge. Because then no one could really guard you because of rubies and stuff. Here, everyone's going to be able to guard these Ben Simmons. It's going to be horrible. So that's what i got to say about this position. Now, if you want to Sapphire, Middleton. That's the only answer. Middleton and Ingram are the only answers. And actually, I gotta pick up this brand Ingram because the one I'm using is actually the 20. So I really gotta pick that up real quick. So I'm gonna do that in a little bit. But anyways, if we go to Power Forward, Siakam, do not pick him up. Zion, I did not pick up the Zion. But if you need someone to get boards out of the rim, it's literally the definition of Zion. Uh, obviously, speed is pretty good for him. I drew him John Collins because he's a budget, and he's coming off the bench, I'm not a word. But this Zion car is a beast. Now, we're going to sever. Pick up this uh, car. Now, let's look at this price. He's so cheap. He's so cheap. Please pick him up. That's all I got to say about that. If you go to the Amethyst, there's Jokic and Embiid. Now, both of these guys are good pickups. If you want to pick them up, pick them up. I think they can get boards, and they can shoot a little too. And, uh... Yeah, that brings you everything you need for a center in this uh, in this case. Now, if you bump it down, Sapphire, Kristaps is the best choice off the bench because he is tall, which makes him a good rebounder. He can protect the rim, and he can shoot a little, so he's the best there in that case. But I think otherwise, that is really the, this is really the best, not the best, the best budget lineup you could use, uh, other than these the uh, these three guys. Now, I highly suggest the yeah, um still go out there and try and snipe the cards I was telling you to call, uh, snipe especially if you can cop on those uh, Lillard Irvin or Curry that would be huge for the point guard position for me I was not a little, I was not worried because trades come off the not Marco so I'm not really worried about that and then if you could get Tatum whew, imagine if I had Tatum in this lineup right now this would be a dirty starting lineup but I think this is really the way to go y'all so this is the best budget Limited lineup, best little budget limited lineup, but I still showed y'all the best players you could get still. Um, now, if you're talking, you know, best diamond, ruby, and it's like I said, that I can't really give you. That's all depends on your play style. And personally, Baka, he could fit anyone's play style. So, yeah, I think he's going to be great. If you want to put him at the center, that also works. That's the best part about Baka. And I feel like these two cards, just, it's all about play style. He just fits my, fit my play style. So I'm gonna go ahead and use these cards. So let's hop right into the game, yo. All right, yo. So I'm hopping to my game. Oh, okay. I got immediately, man. I was not expecting to write that quick. I thought I could do a little intro, but anyways, let's look at who we're playing. So we are gonna be playing this Irving, Dick Barnett, MPJ, who's gonna be a beast, and this Jeremy Grant, Bam Walker, and he's got oh, his bench is horribly bad. I think he's gonna keep starters in all game, but that's fine because. In this case, it, it won't matter, and I honestly think he, he, he picked all right. He picked all right. That MPJ and Kyrie are going to be tough, I feel like, but Middleton, he's going to have a rough time, but I, I think it'll be all right, man. Oh, and his jerseys, I hope we're not playing on his home court, because that's going to be toxic as hell, to be honest with y'all. Oh, my. I think, oh, we're playing on his home court, because I don't have any rec. Oh, my. So he has a toxic court. I, oh, I like the pickle Rick. Pickle Rick, you know what I'm saying? So let's get right into this game, you know. Uh, third ring. Looking to get it. Last week I got a real quick. I couldn't even get y'all gameplay. Hopefully I can get it real quick again and get y'all gameplay, you know. Two for one, you know what I'm saying? So let's get it right. Let's get it right, you So I'm going to start off right here. Markel, pick and roll. And it looks like he's going to off ball. And Labaka. And good bucket from Labaka, bro. I'm ready to get this started, yo. 
Now, this is how he's uh, rim run, I'm guessing, with him, because that's what people do a lot in this. Uh, wow, that form is strippy, yo. That form is strippy. That, that always messes me up. I'm playing horrible offense, so I just gotta get that going. Uh, I think I'm just gonna run with that snatch back, because if he's gonna off ball, give me one. Markel with the three. We like that, Markel. We need that, yo. I'm gonna play uh, the bottom then. Good steal by Rudy on the break. Here we go, Markel. It, uh, oh, Rudy. For three. Green! Come on, Rudy. Let's go, yo. Man, I wouldn't be surprised this guy quits already, because he's gonna keep running, running. So, it looks like I seem to play all guys who just rim run now. I don't know what the chat is. It's like a trend at this point. Uh, come on, three. Markel. Wide open, yo. Man, you don't know about that, yo. You don't know about that. He's not playing up. I'm gonna keep hitting them threes. I'm gonna keep hitting them threes. I'm gonna make him pay, yo. I'm telling him, yeah, you got hit some threes, you know what I'm saying? Because he can't win the game rim running. He's gonna have to shoot threes. That's that's one thing good about my MPJ. He can go to that rim and get. He always gets a call almost every time. I pretty sure I'll make a game play on that card, but right now he's so much that I'm not really worried about it. I'm gonna go straight to this match back. Come on, give me one more cow. Markel is a beast, yo. I just picked this card up because everyone's like, yeah, he's good. I was not picking him earlier because he was so expensive. He dropped down by like 7k, and I was like, alright, let me cop now. It might be my best time. And boy, was it my best time already. It is. Oh, I thought he was about to quit. Y'all was like, he's so hype, bro. Because I was like, yo, are we gonna get a rage quit? And I don't know where to go to. We're going to Rudy Green. Let's go. Is he quitting? Let's go. We already got a rage quit in the books, yo. Man, Rudy Fernandez is such a dumb. I'm so glad I picked that card up, yo. He is so nice with it. And so is that Markel. That's why you gotta have a sick backcourt. That dude's lineup was terrible. Can I please get this third ring really quickly, yo? This should be great. Come on. I'm always going left. I won't left. No! 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 I missed the ring! I missed the ring! It was on the right! I missed it, yo! Oh, no, I missed the ring! Man, this happened last time, too, where I got the worst one on the first try. Man, I already know. I already know. Me editing this video, I already know I put some clown music in there, too, man. Oh my god, yo, let's just get right into this next game. Alright, yeah, so I'm gonna be hopping to one and I'm our team, trying to get this ring real quick. Now, I'm gonna be songs with you I just played a rim runner and lost, and I'm, like, really mad. I'm trying to leave in the past. Yeah, I like never happened. So, right now, we're gonna be playing, okay, Rudy, Luca, Ben, okay. So, I do not play up with Ben Simmons. That's gonna be good. This guy also has Mark, Hell, and Rudy. So, we have a similar lineup. I'm not too worried about Luca. Because if y'all saw his stats, nothing. Oh my, playing Westbrook again. And I don't know why I'm not happy about playing Westbrook right now, but let's just say uh, the last couple games, because I played two and lost three runners. They said that Russell Westbrook is not good. He's not good. He's annoying. Yeah, that's all I gotta say. So, well, I'm, I just. Can they please take out Rimrunner in this game, yo? It's, it's, it's annoying. Because people are right. Like, it's. Holding stick straight, holding square, getting and one fouls on me. Like, what? Anyways, new game. Uh, yeah, let's get into it. Now, my plan is this Ben Simmons. Abuse him. Now, looks like uh, he's going to ruin this. It's this one. My Marco Volts is ruined. You know, I, I like this Marco Volts. Crazy for me to be this. So, here we This guy's just going to... He's done nothing once again. And he's going to get bailed out by... Nothing new. Okay, big three there for Markel. Markel is an absolute beast. And I'm just gonna keep chopping with him to be so honest, I think. And if he's not playing up on that, I'm gonna keep shooting him. Good three once again. Like, it's help defense. Come on. 2K, like, I don't understand. Green! Rudy Fernandez is a He's a... He's a bucket right now. I said I really need that. <sighs> Alright. three right there let's go yo i'm i'm literally not missing right now and i gotta play if i can play some defense it's gonna be fun good defense right there that's all i needed now watch why is he cutting wide open once again and oh rudy wide okay i'm um, jumping all the way come on throw it down right on markel let's go rudy damn rudy he's 
It's a Markel showing out, but today looks like it's Rudy Middleton. Okay. Let's go deep three with Fultz. Let's go, Markel! I love that one when I'm like I can't green right now, but yo, this car I was green with all day, so no sleep on him. That's all I'm gonna say. In the quarter, he's gonna miss. All right, I'm up seven after the first. I've been greeting with Mark all day, but right now I'm not. Rudy Fernandez showing out. Are we gonna get a rage quit? Let's go! Rage quit. Yo, I feel like this guy looking at a chance. I don't know why he rage quit. And after playing two rim runners, I'm feeling great. How? Well, I've have to play two rim runners. I'm feeling phenomenal, yo. So let's hope I can get this ring, yo. Please, please, please. Because after my, I went to the paint. I'm missing it. Come on, in the middle. I'm left. No, I. Oh my god, just cue the clown music. You don't even need to tell me, yo. Cue the clown music. <sighs> Alright, y'all, uh, so we're gonna about, we're gonna find out who we're playing this game. And we are playing. Oh, wow, this guy's team is horrible. We're playing Silver, Michael Jones, Lillard, McCollum, Butler, Ubre. Um, I don't know what he was trying to do with this team, but, um, okay. Alright, so this is the team we're playing. Uh, Cat's gonna have a field day. Because, you know, everyone on this team can shoot. So he tries to double to send out to the shooter. And we're gonna be shooting all game then, so. Looks like uh, I'm. Yeah, he's silver, so I'm feeling good about this. Uh, a toxic ass court again. It's bright white, I don't know why. Watch, oh, okay. I was gonna say, watch him have like a white ball too. That'd be annoying. So. Let's get this started, yo, and I'm, I'm being ready, yo, I swear. If Kelly Oubre is some demon or something, get that out of here. Let's go. I, I wouldn't be surprised if Kelly Oubre randomly became the greatest player of all time after today. To be so honest, because after the last couple games I've played, yo, I would not be surprised, to be so honest with you. Because it's been rough, and is he going to rim run? I, I have no clue what I'm in store for him. Okay, so I'm in store for a pick and roll. And good defense right there. Uh, I think we're gonna need a rage quit this game. Easily dunk it on him. Let's go, Rudy. Man, Rudy's showing out. I thought it was Markel for all these games. And now when I... It was a rim running game, so that was Markel. Maybe, maybe that was what I was doing wrong. Maybe I just need to go to Rudy more. And now he's gonna rim run all over it. Come on. Oh, I gotta get the paint. I gotta get the paint. Oh, good contest. Yes, good shit, bro. This guy is not getting anywhere. Give it right to Rudy, yo. Already has slashing take, yo. Rudy is a dog, man. This is why you guys have to pick him up. This guy's got slashing take. Oh, you know what that means? Snatch back, green. Let's go, yo. That means they think I'm on in. That's what y'all thought too. That I was about to go in, right? Right? Hell no. Nah. Means I'll just pass it out to the open guy next time. He's not hitting that terrible release. Good in the game. He's good in the game. Let's go. Let's go. He's good in the game. <sighs> oh my. Oh, I better get this ring. I better get this ring. I'm upset. I want this ring so bad. I've been getting. For some reason, the best minute. The best stuff has been on the right today. But I don't care if it's on the right. I'm going to keep going left. You know? Come on. In the middle. I'm on left. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Three rings. Three rings. Let's go, y'all, man. I hope y'all enjoy this video. I just got my third ring. And, yo, to be honest, um, I just showed y'all Rudy and Mark Heller dogs, man. Like, I feel like, I'm, this is not, like, this is about winning the limited game, right? It's not about, I'm not trying to show y'all that, you know, what's it called? That these other guys, like, they're just base cars. They're not good. I'm not gonna try and make them look good. They're not good. It's as simple as that. Like, thank y'all for watching this video. Though. This Marco is a absolute beast. I highly say y'all pick him up. And this Rudy, his backcourt really carried me today. Hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I'm out.